Yes, people. All right, good afternoon and welcome to BBC News Pigeon Facebook Live. Right. Uh, this afternoon, we turned out for um, the Golden Tulip Hotel, where the, the place where the Super Eagles is stayed. Super Eagles just arrived at uh, their hotel ahead of their game on Friday. Um, so far, so good. Um, the trip from the airport down to the hotel, it not take too long. But now they don't land. As you see, if you see assistant coach Joseph Yobo also there for staying there. Um, one by one, the players will come out. And uh, if you just join us, we welcome you. Um, that game, like I, uh, the caption talk, it will start on Friday, 7:30 p.m. Nigeria uh, Ghana time and 8:30 p.m. Nigerian time. Um, I'm the media officer of the team, but uh, Raji and just dropped from the um, vehicle. Uh, team doctor also just come down from the vehicle. Uh, one by one, the players will begin to come out so that uh, they will fit to uh, enter their hotel. Uh, but um, I can give on a small background information ahead of that match on Friday. Um, but I mean, like I said the players only really come out one by one. Yes, uh, this Nabasi, I'm the first player. We the uh, we just come down from the vehicle. As you see as well, the fifth CC choose Econ. Now they follow next as the player. Um, the next na uh, I know. Yes, Aribo. Uh, Yusuf also assistant coach. You uh, see Daniel Kwe, one of the goalkeepers. And also uh, Leon Balogu, that's Shemi Ajayi. One by one, they just they come out like that. Moses Simon, and he just passed so. Uh, then Ola Lukman will uh, maybe get your first cap on Friday. Let me see the chosen. Um, also, you don't see another assistant coach that just announced not far away. Manuel uh, Munike just passed, the coach. Osina Dwavon just passed too. Uh, so you see. Sherry Abdullahi and uh, the captain of the team as well, um, Musa Nahim just come down. The next person will be Thomas now, of course, now the Nigerian striker Juju Galo. Uh, next, uh, now Chukweze, and of course, we get uh, Osime too. I can't believe Amao just received new cap and I follow next, and uh, Samusi be next uh, after Amao. Francis Uzo Hallway, the one of the goalkeepers too. Uh, it did, uh, all of them they wear the mark, so if you don't see their face uh, in full, but uh, in Anacho himself, you know, wear his own mask and he fits here and he fits uh, the cognizer. A table we don't get out for uh, with injury after a while, also don't, uh, don't land for the Ghana too. And uh, so far, so good. All the players with them call up, but them don't come down from the vehicle to enter their hotel. Like I've been telling you before, um, the game now on Friday, and uh, the two legged affair, that's what I mean, say they will play home and away before they will decide uh, who among Ghana and Nigeria go uh, pick their tickets to um, Qatar 2022 World Cup. And um, of course, like normal, like always, we see new speech in the show and every two ways they happen. For players can, we also bring on a live text update for a website as to, uh, for you to follow the game if you need to watch them when you do traffic or you do a uh, place where TV, you know, they, if you also follow up our website, we see news speech in um, This afternoon also, then I will hold their own press conference, which we will also be there too, to see how things be. And this evening, uh, the final training session will go um, this evening. And also, like I tell you, BBC News Pigeon will uh, also bring another live update. Um, the players, one by one, just they enter the hotel where they do lodge and also um, resume uh, training later this evening. Um, yeah, make I take one or two messages with the way. Uh, I don't say all of the welcome the Eagles to Kumasi. Some Ghanaians with for comments don't welcome the Eagles to Kumasi. Um, yes, thank you very much, and thank you to everybody who joined us to watch this uh, arrival video of the Super Eagles of Nigeria. Um, just before we end the live video, like I tell you now, um, the match on uh, Friday, 7:30 p.m. Ghana time and 8:30 p.m. Nigeria time. Um, if the game ends for draw, they will still wait to play the second leg next week, Tuesday, where Nigeria will host for uh, Abuja. The team where gets highest aggregates 
uh, score, Nain will progress to Qatar 2022 World Cup. Um, good afternoon and uh, thank you for uh, joining us. And here we go also Madrid because as you don't see, all the players don't enter inside their hotel. Journalists know they to enter for now due to COVID uh, uh, procedures. But uh, make you also stay with us where we will continue our uh, live coverage of the Ghana versus Nigeria Qatar 2022 World Cup qualifier. And um, don't forget, all the updates we need from pre-match interviews down to previews, down to head-to-head -head where these two teams don't play, uh, all you will see stay on our website, bbcpigin.com. Um, I thank every one of you who joined us this afternoon. Um, I will be match break and uh, make sure I enjoy the rest of another day.